Julia. Oh, Julia, why is she going in such a rush? I can't explain now. Look after Adam. He's alive, Carolyn. He's alive. Adam, what's wrong? Adam! I'm for you to breathe. Please, Adam. Try to sit out. Maybe you'll feel better. Adam, can you hear me? If you can sit out. Oh, Adam. Please. Please. Adam. Adam. I can't find a full speed. I can't. wrong? Have you ever had anything like it before? Before? No. You kept talking about Barnabas. Barnabas? No, Adam, please don't get up. Barnabas. Adam, you must rest. Why did I talk of Barnabas? I don't know. I thought you were. Adam, heavens. Professor. Adam, this is incredible. You shouldn't be standing up, Adam. Are you, are you all right? He says he is. I don't understand. I want to go home now. It's as if it had never happened. He doesn't remember anything he said. I'm sick. This place made me sick. No, no, Adam. It, it wasn't the place. Yes. We go home now? Well, yes, that would be pleasant, but we can't. The police, they are still looking for you. They visited me once, they may again. Professor, he can't stay here. He doesn't understand. He thinks, he thinks it's this place that gave him whatever he had, and you may be right. No, no, it, it, it wasn't that. Well, there has to be a logical explanation. For once, I would tend to doubt that. Professor, he has to be examined by a doctor. Julia's coming. She can examine him. Julia! No, Julia! Julia, your friend of Barnabas. Julia will turn him over to the police. She told me that. I can stop her. He's afraid of Julia. He doesn't trust her either. You, you can't subject him to that. For once, I must admit, I, I don't know what we should do. You must forgive me. It's been a long time since I had this feeling. Usually, I'm very decisive about what steps to take. We, we must find some place to hide him. From Julia, as well as the police, yes, I, I would agree to that. And someone has to take care of him. I can take care of Adam. Adam, soon you'll be able to, but not quite yet. Now, I show you. No, no, Adam, you'll be caught. You know what he might do to you. <laughs> Professor, he doesn't understand. He's like a child. No. I don't know where he'll be safe. I do. I do. The West Wing of Collinwood. It's been closed off for years. It's always kept locked. Nobody ever goes there. And, and I could bring him food. No. No. But it's perfect. Why not? Because someone else will be looking for Adam. Someone who has access to Collinwood. Someone who will be desperate to find him. Who are you talking about? Barnabas Collins. Barnabas. But even if Barnabas did want to find Adam, he would never think that I'd hidden him. And why would Barnabas be desperate to find Adam? Professor? Neither of us know the answer to that question. But one day, I will. No one saw us. This will keep you warm. No, just 
one. Someone might see from the outside. There. Now, you'll be safe here for a while, Adam. I'll be back later with some food. No! 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 Please! Don't let me go! You're choking me! No! Don't go! Please! You stay! Now! Adam, listen to me. I have to leave. They'll wonder where I am. No. No! Shh, shh. Be quiet. Someone might hear you, Adam. You've got to be quiet. And try. Try to understand. You're in danger. They want to find you. And hurt you. Hurt me? Yes. Hurt Adam. Others. That's why we have to hide you. Hide you, so that they won't be able to find you and hurt you. Hurt? Why hurt? Because they're afraid of you. They don't know what you're like. I, I do. Do you see, Adam? I'm your friend. Adam? Yes, I know. And friends help each other. I want to help you. To keep you safe. But I can't do it if I stay here. They'll come looking for me and, and they'll find you. That's why you have to stay here alone. Alone? No! Not be alone. Adam, you'll be all right. Yes, I promise you will be. But you must stay here. And you must be absolutely still. Please trust me, Adam. Please stay. I stay alone. Trust me. Friend. Friend. I trust. Alone. Carolyn! David, I thought you were downstairs. I was. I was trying to get my stepmother to help me with the tape recorder. But she's too busy to help me with the tape recorder. But she's too busy. I wish I could help you with it, David, but uh, I'm a little tired right now. Carolyn? Yes? What were you doing in the West Wing? What? Well, what were you doing in the West Wing? You just came from there. What makes you think that? Well, I just saw you locking the door. David, let's go into your room. What were you doing in that part of the house? I was uh, looking for something for Vicky. She's so interested in the family's history, I was trying to find some old family pictures. Then why were you so careful about locking it? Because of you, for one thing. You know your Aunt Elizabeth doesn't like you prowling around the deserted part of the house. It's very dangerous. Since your curiosity is so difficult to control, doors have to be locked. Where are they? Where what? The pictures. I, I couldn't find the ones I was looking for. Thank you.
morning. I brought you breakfast. Carolyn, I was afraid. Afraid? I was alone. Afraid. Afraid I wasn't coming? Yes. Adam, you know, I always come to bring you food. It's difficult sometimes. I have to wait until everyone is out of the kitchen and be very careful no one sees me coming up here. You're not afraid now, are you? No. Not afraid now. Good. Sit down and eat your breakfast. No. Adam, you have to eat. No, Carolyn. Listen. Listen to what? The... The widest land. The widest land? Doom takes two. Adam, what are you trying to say? Read! The widest land doom takes to part us. Leaves thy heart in mine with pulses that beat double. What I do and what I dream include thee, as the wine must taste of its own grapes. And when I sue God for myself, he hears that name of thine and sees within my eyes the tears of two. Tears. Two. Two. Adam, did you read this? Yes. That's amazing. You were able to read only the simplest senses a few days ago. When I am alone, I read. Adam, I'm so proud of you. Yes, you are proud. Very proud. What does it mean? It's... It's a poem. Poem? A love sonnet. Love sonnet. That's right. But what does it mean? It's... It's a poem written by a woman telling a man how much she loves him. Woman? Loves man? Yes. Woman loves man. All right. Class is dismissed. Now, you sit down and eat your breakfast. Carolyn? What is it, Adam? Carolyn. Afraid of Adam? No. No, of course I'm not afraid of you. Carolyn hates Adam. No. No, of course I don't hate you, Adam. I'm your friend. Now you have your breakfast. I have to go. No. Adam, I have to leave now. Then miss me downstairs. No. Stay. Here's a sample. No! 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 Mm -hmm. 
He tried to kill me. I don't care what he tried to do to you. You mustn't harm him. But he tried to kill me! He won't kill you. He won't do anything to you. I won't let him. He will bring the police. He threatened to turn you over to the police. Yes. Well, he's not going to do that. He's not going to do anything to you. I'll see to that. Adam, you trust me, don't you? Yes, I trust you. Then give me the knife. Adam, give me the knife. Now let him leave. Adam, you must do what I'm telling you to do. Let him go. Thank you. No, thank me. I have plenty to say to you. You better wait for me outside. Wouldn't you be I back? said, wait for me outside. I want to have a talk with you. Okay. Adam, do you understand? Yes, I understand. Good. Someone. But he lied to me. He tried to kill me. I don't care what he tried to do to you. You shouldn't have tried to kill him. No? No. Even if he attacked you with a knife, you shouldn't have tried to kill him with it. You should have taken the knife away from him. And that's all. Do you understand? Taking the knife away from him? That's right. And killing is wrong. Under any circumstances. Do you understand that? Killing is wrong. Do you understand what you're saying? Do you know what it means? Yes, I understand. You must promise me that you'll never try to harm anyone again. And you must keep that promise. Or I can't go on helping you. you go away? Yes. Unless you promise me you'll never try to hurt anyone again. Promise. And will you keep that promise? For my sake? Yes, for you. Good. Because Harry Johnson will be bringing you food sometimes, and you mustn't try to harm him. Harry brings food, not Carolyn? Sometimes he will. It, it isn't always possible for me to do it. Good. You don't want to see me. Adam, of course I do. Just sometimes... Well, it, it isn't possible, that's all. Adam, please try to understand that. I will try. Good. Well, I'd better go now. No, wait. What for? Picture. What picture?
here, look. Oh, it's... It's an old lithograph. It's lovely. Please explain. Well, it's a... It's a picture of a couple kissing. Kissing? It's... It's what people do when they love each other. Love each other. Adam, I'd better go now. No. Adam, I must. Tell me. I... What is wrong? Adam, you must never try to do that again. Why? Because, well, because it, it's, it's not right. You hate me. No, no, of course I don't hate you, Adam. But we're friends, and that's all we ever can be. I don't understand. Adam, I, I can't explain it to you now. I have to go. I'm sorry. Carolyn hates Adam. <laughs> 